variable acceleration, example 6, part A, we need to find the expression for displacement, so we integrate the velocity equation, so x is equal to ht minus t squared, so this gives us 4 t squared, increase the power by 1, then divide by the new power, so it's 1 third t cubed plus c. Because we're starting from the origin, so when t is 0, x is 0, this means 0 equal to 0 minus 0 plus c, so therefore c is equal to 0. So the expression for x is just 4 t squared minus 1 third t cubed. Part B, we have to find the expression for acceleration. So acceleration is when we differentiate the velocity equation. So we have v is equal to 8t minus t squared. So we differentiate. we get a, so that's 8 minus 2t. So that's the expression for acceleration. You can write unit next to it, meters per second squared. Part c, find the dis distance covered and the velocity at the moment when the acceleration is zero. So when a is equal to 0, this means 8 minus 2t is equal to 0, and we get t equal to 4. So we have v is equal to 8t minus t squared. So when t is equal to 4, velocity is 8 times 4 minus 4 squared. So that's 32 minus 16, that's 16 meters per second. Then we find the displacement when t is equal to 4 x is equal to, let's use the equation, so 4 times 4 squared minus 1 third times 4 cubed, so that's 64, minus 64 divided by 3, and we use the calculator, so we get 42.7 meters. So part D, the average velocity is equal to Total displacement, so average velocity is equal to the displacement divided by time. So the displacement is 42.7 divided by 4, so we get 10.7 meters per second. Now the assumption is the velocity was positive during the first four seconds. Because a continuous curve um, it was positive. If we plot the graph 
to the first four seconds. So v is equal to eight t minus t squared. So when t is equal to zero, so the velocity is zero. When t is one, eight minus one is seven. Then t is two, sixteen minus four is twelve. Then t is three, twenty four minus nine plus fifteen. Twenty four minus nine is fifteen. Then when t is four, thirty two minus 16. So the velocity is positive in the first four seconds. So therefore this answer is correct.